Today we're going to talk about the versatile rotary actuator device from Pangolin. We call it VRAD for short. Our goals in creating the VRAD were to create a great replacement for the industry standard GM20, but having many additional benefits. To offer a set of features which makes it very versatile, hence the name versatile rotary actuator device. And because of its versatility, we believe it has applications outside the laser industry. When we compare the similarities of the VRAD and the GM20, as you can see in the picture below, the package size is really pretty comparable. Another similarity is that it's connectorized, making it easy to connect to wiring harnesses. The shaft size is the same as a GM20, which means it will fit existing actuator arms and mounts. And the inertia and spring return are also similar which means that the speed and response time are similar, slightly favoring the VRAD. Like the GM20, there are no stops. This gives you smooth, shock-free motion with no clack-clack at the end of the motion. So now let's talk about some of the differences. Unlike the GM20, the spring return mechanism is facilitated by a very clever magnetic design. This means that there's no torsion bars to wear out or break. Another difference is that it has both a front shaft and a back shaft. This means you can actuate two things simultaneously, or you can actuate a position sensor or an encoder to one of the shafts to give higher precision motion. The VRAD offers high quality bearings with axial preload. The GM20 and MFE use a radial preload, which means that if you grab the shaft and moved it, you could feel some slight vibration at the end and we offer access to two drive coils for versatility whereas the GM20 only provided access to the series combination now what you could do with this is put the two coils in series for low current higher voltage drive or put the two coils in parallel for higher current lower voltage drive and there are some other versatile applications that you can do with it as well now the biggest differences between the VRAD and the GM20 is that the VRAD offers completely linear position versus voltage profile and also the possibility to drive the actuator to nearly plus and minus 90 degrees. If you put the two coils in series you can see that it offers about 2.5 degrees per volt. This gives you 30 degrees with 12 volts applied to the actuator. If you put the two coils in parallel you can see this gives approximately 5 degrees per volt, offering 60 degrees at 12 volts into the actuator. The pricing, this is always very important. The GM20 was quoted at $225, even in a pretty decent quantity. Latex rotary actuators on the internet go for around $150. The VRAD price is $99 for a single piece, and the price goes down as the quantity goes up. This is our first model of the actuator. Other larger and smaller actuators are possible, and we currently have a half-inch round model already in development. For more information, contact Pangolin Laser Systems.